I was watching some people were giving their lists of their top five HBO series ever, and I was stunned to see some people leave The Sopranos out of it. Mm. Like, oh. and then now HBO has had some gr- obby, great series, yeah. but to leave The Sopranos out of that is like agreed. Blowing to me. I'm trying now, to figure out what number one is. The Wire. I'm watching The Wire currently. I feel like I'm up to date on it. After the first season, it falls off a bit. You talking about The Wire? Yeah. I'm actually powering through kind of season four right now. Like, uh, you know, I'm watching this mayor who wants to be governor, making choices that are kind of corruptish, you know, trying to capitalize on a homeless issue that's all founded on bullshit. And I'm like, ah, it was so cool when this was about drug dealers. Yeah, see, yeah. I, I'm in the same boat with you now because I'm on, I think, late season three. And mm. yeah, I, if they would have stuck with that same track from season one, I think it would have been better, especially with the season two doc nonsense. But reg- regardless of that, <clears throat> Sopranos is number one. Uh, the Wire's number one for me. Sopranos number two. Uh, Curb Your Enthusiasm is probably number three. I love Deadwood, um, but it was so short. Um, you know, it, 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 it left on such a bad note. Yeah. Um, uh, as far as stuff that's been out recently, I like Barry a lot. I like Barry a lot. Uh, I think it's really good. <laughs> mm. I'm going to the third season. Boardwalk Empire fa- falls off a lot after spoiler alert. Spoiler alert for Boardwalk Empire. Jimmy Darmody dies. Uh, after that happens, I don't really care so much. Yeah. Um, Chernobyl, I don't think you count that as – I think that's a mini series, but oh, I, I, it was what incredible. About, what about Entourage? I've never seen Entourage. Never watched it. Oh, you, you know what I, by the way, for me, is a great comedy? Veep. Great. Underrated, yes. Veep is fantastic. Now, I don't know why. It's like the same joke again and again. Uh, politicians talking in a way that's way cruder than you'd expect them to. Yeah. But I will watch that joke apparently for nine years and like it every time. Every years? I don't know. Something like that. It was it, a really funny show. But 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 I think Deadwood you didn't like Deadwood? I love Deadwood. I love Deadwood. It just didn't end right. Like it, at the end they of season canceled. two, like they got canceled, so they made one sort of rap episode and you're like, That's oh. it? There's no three, there needs to be. Then they did the at movie. At the end of season two, you've got these two sides. You've got you've got uh that, that guy who's moved into town with all of his hired guns and he's bringing more hired guns, and then you've got all the townspeople, Schillinger and everybody has like banded together and like, there's gonna Shelling her, and they're <laughs> gonna have a big showdown, and then they're just like, "Oh, we got canceled. We, we've got thirty-seven thousand dollars to make the final episode." Well, <laughs> what if, uh, Look, what if we all just say, <laughs> "What if we just say fuck it," and uh, we uh, we just get on a wagon and we tip our hat and we just say goodbye and we leave? How about that? Well, that sounds awful. Oh yeah. shit, because that's what I wrote. <laughs> <laughs> that fit the budget. Yeah, I, I hear you. I I love that. There's one where there's a language barrier. Is it between Schillinger and the, and the, the Asian guy? Yeah. And they're just like, cocksucker? Motherfucker. I don't know what they say. But. <laughs> yeah, it, pretty much. They're, like, <laughs> they're, they're literally like making hand signals, drawing crudely on a, on a single page of paper and going, cocksucker, big cocksucker, Schillinger, Schillinger, big Wait, is- cocksucker, wang. Is and he's Game like, of Thrones not on any of your list? I struggle no. with it. I I thought Game of Thrones was literally not just the best HBO show, but the best well, show to have ever been Thrones. created. And then it fell off for seasons seven and eight, maybe six, seven, and eight. And kind of like Matrix Three, it was so bad it dented my opinion of previous seasons. Absolutely. Awful. It's not. It's absolutely not in my top five HBO shows. Oz is above that because even Oz had a fucking wrap up. They got you through the whole story. Try watching Oz and then facing face down the gun of eight, eight or twenty years yourself uh, about eight months later. <laughs> See how that makes you feel. 